Contrary to what this guy says, we would not use shotguns for space combat, and there are really two big reasons for that. The first is it costs like $2,000 at least to send one pound of something into space in order to put a Remington 870 with a full tube of five rounds, that would be about $15,000. Meanwhile, you could essentially 3D print a polymer with a little bit of aluminum and a little bit of steel pistol chambered in something like an advanced 17 HMR with a steel core, that'll be important later. And for the same price of giving one person one shotgun full of one tube of shells, you could equip an entire squad with like 10 weapons, 100 rounds each. Just something plastic would make more sense. And reason number two, spacesuits right now have like four to five millimeters of Kevlar, and looking at body armor ratings, that's enough to stop buckshot. But like four millimeter steel core bullet going pretty darn fast, that'll go through. So we would not use shotguns, and honestly we probably wouldn't use what I just said either, because as soon as we realize that there's shooting going on in space, we're gonna put more armor on. And that's when you would see gyrojets with warheads becoming more popular.